Hi, good afternoon. I'm Gio from Just Kidding Films TV. And I'm on location in Los Angeles. And we are here to explore the often misunderstood stereotypes of homeless people. Behind me are members of the homeless community. Hello there, I'm Homeless Bill. Hello there, I'm third of friend. Oh, why didn't I get the memo that we was gonna have honorary guests? Well, I had no idea we were gonna have company. So how long have you guys uh, actually lived here? Your hair's quite nice, madam. What kind of products do you use to get these luxurious results? Uh, sh shampoo and conditioner. Thank you for asking. Shampoo. Well, you smell like Bath and Body Works to me. It smells like strawberries and cucumbers sitting in the tree. F U C K I and J. Wow. Thank you. I know you're jealous of my mobile home. Well, uh, the homeless community is known to be very resourceful. You got and, right, too. <laughs> and can survive on minimal resources. Uh, what is the one resource that you guys just can't live without? Newspapers! Newspapers to the homeless, or as the buffalo to the Native Americans. Because the Native Americans use the buffalo butt and the buffalo penis for trumpets. We use the newspapers for everything. That's true. The Native Americans used to use the buffalo tail as a sexual fetish device. Because the end of it is a furry and it induces a tickling type of sensation on the buttocks. I've done that myself a couple of times. Goddamn right. Just as the Native Americans use every part of the buffalo from the skin to the organs to the buttocks to the ball sacks, everything, we use every part of the newspaper. Every part. For example, reading glasses, exploration device, blankets, samurai warrior helmet, sword and shield, Tupac, newspaper underwear, iPad. And I'd even masturbate to newspapers. And when I ejaculate, I ejaculate straight into the newspaper. And right before my semen is about to harden, I hurry up and fold it into a pinata and fill it up with candy so I can just give it to some children. Give it to the community. Give them back to the communities. Arts and crafts. Paper machets. Well, thank you for uh, the exclusive look inside a homeless culture. And thank you for blessing us with your heavenly presence. And as a pardon gift, I would like to give you this freshly made pinata. Feel the warmth. I feel it. Smell the Clorox sink up through the edges. Uh, thank you. Excuse the stain on the blazer. Thank you. While most people walk past our luxurious lifestyle, luxury.